is what we waited for Take my hand, we'll make it somehow We can't miss out I'm done living life with the lights out Die with my own doubts Be free, we win Hey you guys, this is Lex Viana and welcome back to Lex in the City Vlogs So, I'm thinking is this like the first? I think this is like the, my first vlog of uh, the new year. So happy new year. Welcome back to the channel. Go ahead and hit that subscribe button if you have not subscribed already. Go ahead and hit that like button if you like this video. And yeah, you know, go watch some more videos while you're here. But um, I wanted to really record today, honestly, because this week has just been madness. Like literally crazy in terms of like my emotions up and down. Um, just things going on in the world. I do want to first start off by, hold on y'all, cause somebody text me. Um, I do want to first start off by saying rest in peace to Kobe Bryant and, um, his daughter Gianna Bryant and all the passengers on the helicopter crash that happened, um, uh, two, it's been like a week, a, almost two weeks, it'll be two weeks on Sunday. Um, so just send my condolences and my prayers to his family. Whew, yeah, so... What's been going on? Let's chat. What's tea? So, first of all, my birthday is literally a week from today. I will be the big 26. Um, feeling very optimistic, very happy about life. Um, and just excited. Honestly, I haven't been recording because life and school have been beating my ass. Um, I'm moving out of my apartment. So, like, right now, my room is a hot mess. .com. Moving out of my apartment at the end of the month, so I've been, like, trying to get that straight um, and organized and all that. And, like I said, school started on January 13th, so next Thursday will be, like, an official month. Um, and that's been going very well. Just a lot of work and a lot of reading and trying to stay focused and organized. I have a lot of work I need to do this weekend, actually, because I ain't going to do no work next week. Birthday week starts and commences and... Um, I'm like with all the shits and all the shenanigans. So, that's just been going on. Um, so, yeah. I wanted to pick up the camera today, though, because I wanted to just recap on... I had an interview yesterday that went really, really well with an advertising agency. Um, and I just really, really hope that that comes through. If it's the right fit, you know, you know. Yeah, just hope that it's a right fit, first of all, the company and the culture and all that. And I, I would really like a new opportunity and new things to happen. But, um, you know, I'm going to leave it all up to the man above. If you guys don't know, I'm actually in school right now for fashion marketing. So what I'm trying to do is I'm really trying to step into, like, the e-commerce world or, like, the fashion world or... Um, advertising and marketing. Advertising and marketing would be great to step into first to kind of learn more so about the business and then go from there. Right now I work in entertainment so they kind of coexist with each other but I just need I just need some a little bit more creative a little bit more. Um, so uh, yeah so I got um I've been ordering stuff and <laughs> doing a whole bunch of stuff trying to prep for my birthday so on top of that i got this sewing y'all and i look at my hair look at my hair and it has to go so i cannot wait to take this out tonight i'm literally have no help so i have to like try to cut my own sewing out this band like all this has to go so pray for me with that because that is going to be um a situation i hope i don't cut my hair because ooh, yikes where is my scissors my room is such a mess, y'all, because I'm moving and I don't, I don't know where to start in terms of, like, all my junk. Oh, here's my scissors. I'm tripping. I have a lot of stuff that's not coming with me in terms of, like, clothes, um, miscellaneous stuff, like, oh, that's what I wanted, my tripod. Um, and just a whole bunch of, like, unnecessary shit that I need to get rid of and I just haven't started. I haven't. I've been focused on other things. The first focus for me was... Um, getting my birthday together. Okay, so I got y'all on the tripod now. Yo, I had, um, just a little TMI, but I think I accidentally had some dairy, like some milk or something today because it's my stomach. Baby girl! It ain't it. It is not it. It's not, it's not working for me. For some reason. So I ordered a whole bunch of stuff 
not a whole bunch of stuff. A couple of pieces for my birthday just because I want to serve like some, some subtle, some subtle looks. You know, I've been kind of like away from the gram and all that stuff like that. But we about to just jump right into like, let me cut this light, this light on. Um, we about to jump into like, you know, full birthday swing of it all. I ordered hair from Maven Hair. They have this thing going on where I seen Jayla Crayon do it. She lives here in New York, so. I kind of trusted her a little bit more than I would trust somebody else because I actually seen her go to the stylist and all the stuff like that. And I could go to the same one. So I literally booked the same stylist um, to do my hair for my birthday. So I'm praying that it gives me that same feel. So the hair came today. And I need to um, check it out. I've never ordered hair from them before. I've heard interesting reviews. So I hope that I like it. So Maven, I got virgin, no, I got Peruvian loose wave hair, 16, 18, and 20 with the 14 inch closure, which is not like me because usually I would get four closures, but I only got three at this, I know you fucking lying. My battery is about to die. Ugh, let me get the other one. This is ghetto. Oh my God. Shout out to my sister for buying me a backup for Christmas. Let me show y'all what I got. First of all, look at this packaging. They literally sent, like this is so obvious that if this was at my um, house, I would be pissed. Because somebody would be like, oh, she ordered shoes. Let me pick this up. Like, why did they do that? I don't know. They've never done that before <sighs> in terms of sending me stuff. And it looks like I should blame DHL for the issues so ugh. I just F the bag up oh it doesn't need to be returned so I got I'm so excited I got these really 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 cute powder blue like mules and has like the square front and like the quilt. Thanks. Work hard. Just a different way. Yikes. Because what the fuck is this? Okay, so honestly, it's cute, but it's too big. So like, it fits the girls, but the waist, it don't fit the waist. And it's supposed to be like a corset type. So it it's it's not giving. Um the only thing that I can think of is I can try to find somewhere to get it altered and like sna like snatched. <sighs> so I don't know if I should keep it or take it back. I don't remember what Pretty Little Things return policy is. I feel like they have a really bad return policy because it's overseas. So I might just like tomorrow go look for somebody who can like literally just snatch in the waist because it's like it's just really big but the concept is really really cute and I like it so if it's the arms and if it's the boobs it's just the waist which is always my issue um it just doesn't fit so that's a little um project that I have to do tomorrow so the idea was to have that and then like the cute heart bag was this is kind of what I think I wanted to give um for like my okay this little net is a hot mess and it's tangled okay um kind of the look that I wanted to give um I don't know what shoes yet I need to look and see what shoes I have or if I'm gonna go get some um but yeah we definitely have to make some type of alterations to this because this is not it so let me try on the other dress and hopefully that uh works out if not then my whole pretty little thing order was kind of a waste <laughs> so we should see we shall see okay so this um it just gives real boxy feel but because i can tighten like clench the waist a little bit i don't know i don't know maybe i need to get like dress you know for me i feel like once i'm like fully dressed i can make something work but i don't know about this i'm not a fan of belts but because i have such a large you know such large breasts 
it I have to have stuff to clench my waist that can separate my top from my bottom because if not it will just get really really lost but this I don't know it's another one of those eh, I don't know because without the belt it just looks like a big ass shirt <laughs> Good morning and welcome back to the vlog. Yesterday was a complete travail. Contrast, whatever the word is, terrible, terrible, horrible, the worst day ever. Um, which I'll get into a little bit later, a little story time about like what happened. But just know my girl Trish came and saved the day and slayed this frontal. This is my first frontal, so I'm a little nervous. But then I'm also like, I'm not gonna know how to act in the process so like i get to play with it and well i still have to play with it and style it and all that stuff like that but for the most part we are you know birthday hair is done birthday nails are done and and now i'm just waiting for like a last little load in the dryer and for my airpods to charge up and then i have to jet like when i say run to my wax appointment literally run because it's at 11 and it's 10 15 and i'm still in the house so, I gotta do that, and then I'm headed to the airport today. Today is the day I'm flying out, or whatever, and going to see Bay to start, you know, our Valentine's slash birthday weekend. I literally last minute packed this morning and threw a whole bunch of stuff in the suitcase. I have to go to the mall because some stuff didn't come. I didn't even order like daytime looks. Just because I've been so occupied with everything else and distracted um, that I didn't even get to like plan out day by day what I wanted to wear, which I usually do. But I don't know. This birthday this year just feels different. Um, I don't know. It just feels really, really different. I guess I can explain it more tomorrow on my actual birthday, but it just doesn't feel like a normal B-day. I guess you could say. I'm like obsessed. I keep looking at myself. I can't wait to like put some makeup on and get all dolled up and all glammed up and all that good stuff. I'm thinking about putting a hat on, but I don't think I am. I think I'll just put like some shades on or something like that for me to get on the, um, get on the, <laughs> what is the thing that I'm getting on the airplane? Um, time is it so I'm actually waiting for these clothes so I'm gonna give them a few more minutes throw them in my suitcase close in my suitcase and literally get out the house um I wasn't going to uber but I feel like I might have to Okay, so I finally have made it onto my flight, y'all. This day has been crazy. But, I finally made it. And I'm on to LA, and then I have to lay over in LA for like an hour, and then I finally go to San Diego. I think this is gonna be like a four light. Like, I'm on like the three row type thing. Never been on one before, so this is cool. A lot of people like this. I know. Instagram. She's on the bike. She's actually covered up. Um, I'm pretty sure it's other people. Good afternoon, And I'd like to get some I'll try to get some
finally off my flight. Got my bags and everything. I was at the hotel about to meet my best friend. Y'all, I have not seen her in a year. So this is crazy. I wanted to record this initial reaction just to see if she gonna act awkward or not because she be acting crazy. Let's see. This hotel is cute. Let me make sure I have the right room number and don't be knocking on a random person's door. Let's see. I would like to also mention that I turned 26 on the East Coast already. And my birthday is in 30 minutes here. So that's cool. Are we going down? Even though this was a hotel, because they didn't have signage outside, they don't have signage Just no type of signage. Figure it out, this was, they pretty much saying. Oh God, this bag's heavy. Okay. Oh, look at you being all cute. Oh, y'all, she tried to be romantic. Well, she is being romantic. This Aww. is so cute. Oh, what's up, though? How you doing? I'm good. How are you? This room is nice. Why does this room ain't? I mean, this hotel ain't have no type of signage or nothing. Why? You passed where? It's my birthday. 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 Can I get some turn up music? This is real slow, sexy, and I'm trying to be like on a motherfucking tilt. Pussy popping. Okay. Pussy popping on a handstand. So my DJ is about to turn, turn me up. But happy Valentine's Day to everybody out there in the world. Happy Valentine's Day to my little yeah, bug. Who was over here on the, the bed trying to put stuff together. Up. Uh, Earl, Earl on the beat. Real ass bitch, give a fuck about a nigga. Stripes in my ass, so he caught his pussy tigger. Fucking on his salmon ass, rich ass nigga. Okay, so we made it to the restaurant. It is called Breakfast Republic, California. Oh, they only open to three. They have like a seven to three situation that we're going on. She really wanted breakfast food, which is weird because she only likes breakfast food. Mm -hmm. But we're going to get into it. Y'all look at her. 
and went and got her some Valentine's Day gifts and she ain't know how to act. I'll take this. <laughs> you ain't broke no more. You got AirPods. Ready? Yeah, welcome to the... Saying, the stream is still... No, it's not. You're going to get so much more respect now you got... Give it to me. Do I have some nails? Really? What is she, what is she on, y'all? I don't like this angle. This is a better angle, but I'm not really in it. Hmm. Why are you whispering? <laughs> Just talk regular. My feet stink. <laughs> it smells like shit. <laughs> nope. <laughs> I'm just Y'all, I had dog <laughs> poo at the bottom of my shoes, and we was in Best Buy, Best Buy like, what the fuck is that smell? I got the camera. What the fuck is that smell? So I lift my right foot up, and <laughs> long behold, there it was. I don't even know when, but I know it was on there for a minute because it was all dried up and nasty, and then I had smelt it for a minute, but I'm so immune to smells because, you know, everything in New York stinks, so... I ain't paying no mind until we got in Best Buy and that shit was humming. She's stinking. So it's just the cord to charge it? Yeah, it's the same charger cord that you use to charge your phone. Speaking of that, here's right. your mm -hmm. charger back. Oh, so I got an extra charger back. Yeah, it's pretty much like an extra charger. Cinema. Alright. Ooh, now I can buy um, cases on like Amazon. Oh, like I'm like cases for what? The actual, to hold it. Got clips and stuff on it. I need to get me one because I always lose my shit. Don't worry, me some. Happy Valentine's Day, honey bun. Happy Valentine's Day. <clears throat> Are you happy with your your gifts? Yes. Uh oh. Uh oh. Mm, and let me show y'all my gift. <laughs> No, you gotta charge it. No, you see the message. Why did you put, why does it say daddy? Bring that back. Y'all, first of all, I don't know who caught, I don't even call her this. What? Focus, focus, focus. Why? <laughs> but why? So that's your percentage of your case, and then that's the percentage of your headphones. All right, Ooh. So we had walked around and went into the stores or whatever. She went shopping. I didn't really get anything because I don't need nothing. And then I have no space in my suitcase to bring anything back. So um, we had went into Saint Laurent at first. Cause I wanted to get a card reader and they didn't have the particular one that I wanted which was the red one with the gold hardware so then um they had a pink one it was like a really pretty like hot pink one with gold hardware but when they just get airpods <laughs> she about to piss me off so um they didn't have the one that I wanted so they was like go to Neiman's and go to Nordstrom so I went we went to both those places still didn't have it so i ended up saying well i'll just get the pink one because i haven't seen anybody with the pink one and when i went back in there she was like as soon as you left like an hour after we got a shipment in and we got the one that you wanted and i ended up getting this for my birthday which is the my video that's copyright so yeah so i got my card reader so i'm about to be a press cut and put uh, all my cards in it now it's so pretty 